Let's make our way to the worst reviewed restaurant in the whole of Vietnam. Let's get in ladies first. Hello, hello. Hi, hi. First things first, let's get the reviews out of the way. See how bad the worst reviewed restaurant in the whole of Vietnam actually is. You must boycott this pathetic restaurant, it's full of thugs. The price is too expensive for the quality of the food. Really bad, the staff behaves like a thug. Are you sure about going to this, bruv? Everyone's meant to be a thug. Like, this is throat cutting, expensive price for mediocre food. One star. The restaurant is dirty, cheating customers, bossy attitude don't come in. One star. Rubbish food and violent staff. See the news report about the woman who was hospitalized for writing a negative review. Boycott. So someone's been beaten up for writing a negative review. I'm not sure about this place anymore, man. What pot? Visual looks like porridge. The taste is missing. But one star review. And there we go. Let's go visit the worst rated restaurant in the whole of Vietnam. Let's see what it's like. Let's see how bad the reviews are. Out of all the big streets is the creepy side street we're going into for this restaurant. It's called Quan and Dick. Well, it's Quan of Wang. Quan and Big Dan. Have they renamed it because it's so shit? I think we found it. It um, doesn't look that bad. It obviously is empty. But I think we found it. Xin chào. Mista, xin chào. Mista, is this a. Let me see the friendliest of people, like the. Um, the man was surprised that we come here and he was looking at us like, what, what are you doing, what are you doing? Oh, cola. Yes. Oh. Okay, they're literally all here. The funniest thing was, it's like, uh, I said, um, is this Juan on, like, I had to, like, reaffirm the name. And they said, uh, she said, who sent you? She said, who sent you, Marcus? Like, she thinks you're a spy. She said, who sent you? Who sent you, Marcus? Man, man, great. Like the people, they're not, they're not that mean. Like they're not, they're not looking at me like I'm a friend, and they're not smiling. So the, the staff are a little bit rude, but I'm excited. I'm just excited to be here. I'm, I'm thinking everyone's happy. So I'm excited to be here. This is the worst review restaurant in the whole of Vietnam. The food has arrived. Marcus has ordered rice, chicken rice, bog standard. She recommended me the mixed grill. It looks stunning, to be fair. The staff man even tried to help me cook, so it's quite nice, I think. But yeah, they're all wearing like, Adidas track suits on my like, roadman outfit, so it does look a little bit like a thug, like a monkey outfit, but. Loads of food, loads of vegetables. Yeah. Nong, nong. Oh, yes. Thank you. I am picking up weird vibes now. Yeah. And my rice. It tastes like rice, it's been like left in the bottom of the rice pan. I think I'm gonna stop eating my rice. Well, that's mad for you, Marcus, because the mixed grill is actually real good. This is nice, I'm watching the football. I'm watching the World This is nice, I'm eating prawns, beef, squid. I'm watching Morocco be Croatia. I don't know, I like I eat anything, but I eat everything. I don't know, but maybe I feel bad for these people, so I'm just. Eating. I'm saying it's good. It is a bit tasteless to be honest. The glaze on it looks amazing. I mean, look, look at that. Last bit is a hot pot. Come on, man. It's not that bad, surely. Like, the sizzle, the food's pretty tasteless. You know, there's just not much flavor. There's a lot of beef. You can't complain when there's a lot of meat. The people are a little bit unfriendly. They're being friendly to us because we're recording and we've got the camera out, so we, you know, we get to the service, but I can see a lot of the um, young boys in the cafe and the director of the restaurant have like cuts on their eyes, they're not even joking. They're wearing, um, they've got like injuries. So they kind of look like happy you know, But um, I'm like, that's the point. Final bite of our meals. Not the final buy. But doesn't deserve the one star rating. That was decent, average. I think it's very, very good to mafia. Why do you think he gets the one star rating? Because it's run by Vietnamese mafia. And everyone's just like, ooh. Yeah, I think what's happened here is that they've had one bad review, and then the Vietnamese mafia here have beaten up the one bad reviewer, and then everyone's boycotted it. The only person that got beaten up, I imagine 
30 of their friends just review bomb this place, say how bad it is. Mister, 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 five star. Yeah. 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 Thank you. You're very welcome. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Thank you very much. <laughs> We literally just spoke to someone and told them that they're eating in the worst. Look at their faces, look at their faces, it's like, bro. <laughs> like, oh. Look at these two old people. <laughs> and they were like, how was the food? They were like, yeah, it was decent, but it was run by Matthew, so you know. Uh, I purposely gave them a five star review and I, and I made sure that he saw that I gave him a five star review, like, just to say that it wasn't as bad as they say. It was a nice place, it was decent. It wasn't amazing food, but it was still food's food, especially meat as well. So that is the worst review restaurant in the whole of Vietnam. Out of five stars, what would you give it? Five. Lit. Mafia made it funny. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. The worst reviewed restaurant in the whole of Vietnam. Lovely to see you guys. See you on my next one. Peace.